Today is Monday, November 21st. Coming almost to the last full week of November and approaching the great feast of, uh, of uh, Thanksgiving. Whatever your plans may be this week, may they, may they go well. Reading from the Gospel of Luke 21. When Jesus looked up and saw wealthy people putting their offerings into the treasury, he knows a poor widow putting in two small coins. He said, I tell you truly, this poor widow put in more than all the rest, for those have made all offerings from their surplus wealth, but she from her poverty has offered her whole livelihood. I know a priest told me, well, not told me personally, but uh, listening to speak, that um, he was raising to build a nice, beautiful new church, and it was quite, a, you know, expensive, and he had to go from, you know, pleading for people and those perhaps in his parish who were God bless in a much more better way, I guess, with financially. He met with them, sometimes taking them out lunch. And, and those who gave him money, and some gave perhaps a um, significant sum, considerable lunch money. But he said when he thanked them for the note, uh, he wouldn't say, thank you for your generous gift. He thanked them for the gift, but he wouldn't describe it necessarily as generous. Because he said, his reasoning was, well, how would I know? Maybe, quote, it wasn't generous for them. It might have been generous for my, you know, for someone in my standings, my economic bracket, but, but maybe for them it wasn't that big of a sacrifice. All right. I said, oh, that's interesting. And the great father of Doherty, when he built his church, he mentioned some fellow, I forget the fellow, you know, man came to see him, wanted to give another sizable donation as well, and he wanted something with his wife's name on it. And Father Doherty was in, insistent that no one, there be no names. And therefore he declined the gift. And that's not such an easy thing to do, all right? Money is not easy to come by. But he said, no, this is the church built by all the people. And who am I to say this person is more important than the, perhaps the one who has less economic means, but still making a, perhaps maybe even a greater sacrifice. And so that's what it says here in our gospel, right? Of, of, the, of the poor widow, two little pennies but for her it was all she had, and that's why it was important. So only God knows if you're generous or not. Others may think so, but it doesn't matter. It's what God sees and what you know about yourself as well. God bless you.